afternoon. I think it's almost afternoon. Um, I had already... Yeah. And that project is 100%, let's say 90. That is how we foresee that. Our supervision to see that the works are done properly. It is our project is, then uh, we'll conclude. Engineer Okuta. Thank you, CEO. Uh, Acho, Waburo Ketu Pump, Matiogi Solar, Okodon Mondo Waket, Pump, Matiogi Steamer, Maburo Chando School, he builds. Uh, thank you very much. It is worth noting that this battle that we have on the streets, year in, year out, it is never a battle to save Kenya from anything. This is a battle to keep the Luo in the tight grip of a single person. We go for this protest in Luo land. We are happy when they are shot dead so that we can go parade those bodies and tell the world that you see the government is killing you and the government is collaborating with your own leaders in government to kill you. Can that be the same statement we have year in, year out since 1997? In 1969, they did the same thing, the same family. They sent people to go and stone Jomo Kenyatta. They were killed. Then for those many years, the Luo believe government is a very bad thing. That is what we are out to change. That the government is for Luos, for Kikuyus, for Kalenjins, or for everyone. Development will come whether our son is the president or not. We are here today with this project as national government. The national government does not discriminate. Even when criminals are shot dead, there is no name on them showing this is a Luo, this is a Kalenji, this is so and so. So this idea of people being paraded in a mortuary and you are told, look at the way what government has done to you. They didn't even tell you that this protest is supposed to be peaceful. You are not supposed to block the roads. You are not supposed to, 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 to extort money from people. We don't want to be out of the government. We want to be in the government so that we also enjoy the taxes that we pay to the government. We don't want to be segregated. Are you getting my point? Elections were over. Matters went to court. Those disputes that were there, they went to court. And there's no way in the Constitution where it is written that when matters are determined in a court of law, then you go on the streets to go and again start negotiating about elections that were already decided even in court. So we must make things very clear. Even what is going on in Bomas is a waste of time, let me tell you. It's a waste of resources for no apparent reason. Nothing tangible will come out of that. Elections were over, President Ruto will rule for the next 10 years. They are entertaining themselves to satisfy their egos. All these issues can be conversed in Parliament and can also be conversed in the Court of Law. Watoto yetu, ambaye watoto ya iluo, ende ni pole pole. Kama wewe na nene naona simba, hapana kuchukua mawe, piga simba na mawe. Wewe naesha kufa. Ni kama wewe na kufa, wewe hapana esha rudi. Iyo simba mimi nasema, si wewe mimi najua yeye. Mimi nasikia. Mimi nasema ni simba. Ni kama wewe naesha kwenda gusa simba, maale wewe na lala, wewe nataka kifo yako. Hata kama sisi si, hiko kwa barabara, haenda na akili msuri, hapana haenda na akili mbofu, wewe tapotea, wewe siwe sikurudi. Kwa hivyo, mimi napiga asendi sana kwa presidenti yetu mpenwa, semoi ruto, kwa mana, nakambuka, watoto wajaluo. We also take note that there is 
unusual reliance on demonstration and violence to drive political agenda home, that is misusing our people. And that is something we must condemn. Yeah. And we condemn that in very strong terms. Our people must not be used for political purposes. Elections are over, we have a leadership. Let's embrace it.